Um, G'day guys and welcome back to Knot of the Week. Um, today we're going to tie a diagonal lashing. A diagonal lashing is different to a square lashing. A diagonal lashing is more, I guess, supportive as much as anything. Whereas a, a square lashing is really designed to support structures. So the first thing we're going to do is tie a timber hitch. So just allow yourself a bit of slack, but you do need to keep your knots nice and tight and neat. Now I'm using a natural fibre rope, that's good because it um, resists itself quite naturally uh, although it doesn't look as pretty I guess as some of the, the nylon or plastic ropes that are out there and what you want to do is come back on yourself about three times there we go Alright, so that's nice and secure, that's step one. Now what we're going to do is we're just going to cross the spars over, that's the wooden spars. I'm using um, Tasmanian oak dowel pieces. Um, that's really for demonstration purposes, although you could quite easily use, uh, you know, it would, although it would be better I think to use now what we're going to do is we can just lay the two spars across together as you can see. Now some people like to wrap one way and then another. I personally prefer the alternate method. Um, I think that's up to you. It achieves the same kind of thing and that's really the, the purpose here. So we just wrap around three times each direction. So that's once. That's twice. Right. Here. Twice. And we'll come out back for a third time. There we are, one, two, and three. And then we just simply finish off with a clove hitch. On the other side. And there we go. Radio, that is our diagonal lashing. Righto guys, thank you so much for watching. Please like, subscribe and share. I'll catch you in my next video.